Hi guys, Tech James here. In this video, I'll be showing you guys how to install a Nintendo Switch interface onto your PS Vita. So you're probably wondering what this is. Basically, all it is is sort of a Nintendo Switch GUI on your PS Vita um, that you can use and open games with and stuff like that. It's more just for um, fun than in anything you know useful, but it's still pretty interesting anyway. So what you guys want to do is go ahead, open up Vita Shell. When it loads, press Select, connect your PS Vita to your PC, and I will show you guys what's do next okay guys so once you're on your pc i will leave a link to the vpk in the description and you can see it's called switch view so all you want to do is scroll down there's a few screenshots of what it looks like but what you're looking for is the latest download version so just click this link and it will bring you to the vita database and then all you want to do is scroll down and just click download vpk so that is just going to start downloading it's very fast then once it's finished downloading, just go back to your downloads folder and all you want to do is make sure your PS Vita is connected and simply copy this across to the root. So that is pretty much it for the PC. So now I'll go onto my PS Vita and I'll show you guys what this application looks like. Alright guys, so back on your PS Vita, we can now go onto the UXO and just find the VPK that we copied across. So it should be on here somewhere. Here is my one, switchview.vpk. So all you want to do is press X on it. Press X to install it. Make sure unsafe homebrew is enabled in Hankaku settings. Then press X for yes. And now just give it a few seconds to install. So once it has finished installing, we can now completely close out of Vita Shell. And you just want to find the VPK on your home screen. So here is my one, switch view. All you want to do is just press X on it and then press X for start. Now what it's going to do is load the Nintendo Switch UI and it's just going to load all your icons from your games and files as well. So as you can see we're on it right now, it looks very much like Nintendo Switch UI, um, it's actually pretty cool. As you can see it's actually got the battery percentage up there in the corner as well. So basically you can scroll through your games and stuff, um, press X and it will actually launch up your game. Let me just show you, so if I choose this game right here, it will just start it up, just like that. So there's a few other things you can do on here as well. Um, you can launch up all your default, you know, PS Vita applications uh, like albums. And then you can also go into um, system settings as well. This one's nice because it brings it up straight away. And you can also go into Exit. So pretty basic program, um, kind of interesting, uh, kind of a nice one to show your friends. You could say that you've got a Switch operating system installed for like a joke or something. But yeah, it's actually pretty cool. I, I like the look of it. Um, not very useful, but still kind of interesting. And this actually could be improved more to do a few other things. And then of course you can use the power button for exit as well and it will just completely close. So that is pretty much it for this video. I just wanted to do a quick video just to show you guys this thing. I thought it was pretty cool and you know it's just a bit of fun. So if you guys enjoyed this video make sure to like and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one.